Yeah, no, not right now. What kind of questions? Well, you see, I'm a writer, and a I was writer. working on this horror novel. Horror novel? <laughs> I was wondering what the serial killer story should be. So a serial killer. Now, is this the kind of serial killer who takes, like, thing of cereal and, like, attacks you with it? Or is it the kind of serial killer that, like, comes to the house and, like, quit? Well, to be honest, I really don't know. I'm kind of working with a blank here. I see. I've been trying to get ideas all day, like... How he should kill people, what his outside composure should be, things like that. Do you happen to have a business card that I could contact you on? Oh, yeah, actually. Oh, perhaps sometime we could meet for lunch and uh, I could help you out with some of that. I actually am an accomplished executive writer for uh, the Titanic, so I shall be back with uh, probably a good yeah. amount of the script and uh, good character uh, build up and uh, probably some scene setups. Yeah, that'd be nice. Just, you know, give me a call. My name's Allison. Allison? That's a very beautiful name. My name is Guy. Nice to meet you. Alright, it's time for me to be a white guy and go that way. Okay, bye. shock you or anything, Miss Allison, but it seems that a good friend of mine who I grew up with as a child drove uh, up to school across the street, so uh, he happened just to point me in the right direction. I uh, hopped over your fence, got past your two guard dogs, and locked them inside. Um, why are you at my house? So, that scripture that you gave me earlier, I was looking at it and I decided that, well, it's just terrible. So, I decided to give you something that was better. It's, uh... Bit of a rhyming kind of thing, but uh, why don't you go ahead and sit yourself down if you don't mind? So, it goes something like this. You go one, two, you buckle your shoe. 
three, four, you open the door. Like this and such. Just like that. Well, not exactly. It's based off of the rhyming of a couple of similes, but yeah, I guess you could call it nursery rhyme if you really wanted to put it that way and sing it to your children. Well, nursery rhyme or not, it sounds like a pretty good idea. I'll see what I can do with it. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> well, I've sadly got to go run away because my house is on fire, so I'll be back. Jenny, I'm coming! Guy, it's Allison. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I finished the manuscript. So, you know, if, if you'd like to come over and see it, it's... Later today? Alright. Um, uh, I'll see you then, I guess. Bye. Kidding me. Hey, Allison. Yeah, I'm at the front. All right, later. I love it. I think it's absolutely great. A little bit of work here and there, but nothing a little bit of uh, elbow grease can't do. <laughs> hey, guess what my favorite part is? What is your favorite part? How do you take your tea? Um, I don't know. How do I like my tea? I like my tea hot, usually, not cold. Mm -hmm. So, as I was saying, my favorite part is when the killer poisons your victim with tea. With tea? <laughs> <laughs> that's that's uh, a little bit unsettling, I would think. Um, don't worry. I don't plan on poisoning you. Yet. 
<laughs> That's so silly. No, oh. oh, why'd you do that? <laughs> uh, sorry. Um, I'm a guest of honor, so you should have the prettiest cup. The prettiest cup? Oh, actually, it is quite a pretty cup. What do you know? Is everything all right, guy? Yeah, um, oh, I'm fine. Why do you ask? Um, why don't we get you outside for some fresh air? Yeah, yeah, fresh air would be nice. Oh, oh goodness, I, I left the kettle on. Okay. You go first, yeah. Oh.